<sighs> Stop! Let me go first. Ooh! Nothing like fresh art supplies! I can barely contain myself! Inspiration is happening. You seeing what I'm seeing? Nope. Then just sit back and watch! I'll start with some white on white. Can't quite see it yet, huh? I really don't get it. These should help. Whoa! The chalk looks huge! But I still don't see a thing! And for me? Ugh. But wait. I won't be needing these. Bye bye Now let there be color! What's meant to be will appear! Getting there! Aha! Uh -huh. Hello? Huh? Impressed? I call it colors. Interesting. Really? Wanna see mine? You can sure see it now! That is so clever! How did you do it? It's simpler than you think. Just draw the subject of your picture, with the white chalk on white paper. Choose your first color and apply it to a sponge. Next color, please! Once it looks like this, sweep it across the page! See how the chalk blocks it? And you're done! So simple, yet so brilliant! Meow! Mesmerized, huh? Hmm. Well, snap out of it! We have to draw a cat? Okay, I guess. This is tricky. Any day now. Whiskers? I could use a little inspiration. Hmm, is she really asleep? Now I can really get to work. Say goodbye, little kitty. You're coming with me. Hey, Ellie. How'd you get that? So unfair! I want one too! But I can be clever too! Ah, good boy! I prefer the real deal! Aww! Mwah. I've done it again! You're my very best friend! And I'm gonna draw you too! You're bigger than I anticipated! Uh, I can't trace you at all! Maybe if you turn just a bit. This isn't working. What a happy accident! You know how to spell cat! Matt! Hold him for a sec! Where'd you come from? Anyway... Let's do this. <sighs> Much better. Time to turn the word cat into... Something a little more cat-like. I'll make this little guy brown. Don't forget the ears. And perhaps a few fun stripes. Almost as cute as the real thing. <laughs> what do you think? Anybody home over there? What'd I miss? Right! Kitties! Cute job, Ellie! That looks awfully familiar, Matt. And now I know why! Sorry! Guess I'm taking this round then! Why do my eyelids always feel heavier in my classes just after lunch? Um, am I boring you, Miss Sophia? Wake up! What? Oh, shoot. Not it off again. Wait a sec. I have an idea. Wish you had a pair of glasses like this to wear through those extra boring lectures. Print out a large picture of you in a pair of glasses like this one. 
cut out each of the lenses of the glasses. Next, stick those suckers right onto your actual specs. You can put double-sided tape on the eyes or clear glue. Perfect fit. Whoa, that looks creepy real. So next time you're sitting in another boring class fighting to stay awake, pop on a pair of these bad boys and head off to dreamland. Hey, Sophia, do you… uh, Sophia? Ugh, that explains it. I'll let her borrow my notes later. She'll need them for sure. Ah, <sighs> sweet dreams, girl. Welcome to Wednesday, the most grueling day of the week. Whoa, I think I nodded off there. Oh man, look what I did! I can't help it if I'm bored out of my mind. Vicky, look what happened! I totally ruined these notes. Wait a sec, I think I know what'll help. These sour lemons are about to make a sweet recovery. Here you go. I hate a lemon You don't have to eat it. Watch. See, it erases highlighter ink. Whoa, did you put a spell on that lemon or something? Okay, back to work I go. Still can't believe this lemon trick really works. Check this out. Rub on a little lemon to your squiggly lemon line here. See? It's totally legit. Ah, another day, another fun project. Hey, what's the matter with these? Why aren't they cutting? There's nothing quite as frustrating as a pair of dull, weak scissors. Psst, Sophia, can I borrow those scissors? Please? Hmm, don't think so. Ugh, that Sophia can be such a snob. Okay, so how am I going to tackle this? Well, I do have these two rulers. Maybe these can work. Take two rulers like these and crisscross them like two blades of a pair of scissors. Start cutting paper with them, pushing them up and down as you go down the page. Whoa, how did you do that? It really does work! All it takes is a little creativity and making use of what's around you. Now that's what you'd call crafty. Ugh, I can't see what I'm doing! Perfect. This hair clip will do. Let me just pull my hair back and clip it right in there. No! Oh, major clip fail. Oh, man. Seriously? This just isn't my day, is it? Sorry, girl. That's a bummer. If you ever have a classroom clip conundrum like this one, we've got great news for you. Turns out these little pencils do a lot more than scribble. Take a clip like this and put some clear glue on it. Next, take a little pencil and stick it on one end vertically. Keep going until you've covered the whole clip. The more colors, the better. Wow, I've gotta say, this looks way better than the clip you had originally, Mia. Whoa, where can I get one of those? I'll tell you, but it'll cost you. Oh, looks like it's recess time. Hey guys, you've got to check out this video. Whoops! Ugh, this is so annoying. Don't worry, girls, I got this. Never mind, I don't got this. Nope, wrong again. Actually, I think I may have the perfect idea. Hmm. Okay, let me take care of this. Let me borrow one of these paper clips. Mm -hmm. This little guy is all we need. Bend the top of the clip back like this. Now bend the tip back the same way. Place it down with the bent pieces pointing upward. Now stick your phone right in the little slot. And voila! Now you can watch your favorite videos comfortably. Oh man, that Vicky girl gets me every time! Man, I really could go for something sweet before science class. Oh good, I remembered to pack my special snack! 
Uh, is that just me or is that lipstick she's talking about? Mmm, that hits the spot. Are you seriously so hungry that you'll even eat your makeup? I could have given you a granola bar or something. Between you and me, this isn't really lipstick. To make your own lipstick snack, take a regular lipstick applicator like this one. Make sure the lipstick's all out. Next, fill a bowl of white chocolate chips like this. Pop them in the microwave so they're all melted. Mix in some food coloring the same shade as your favorite lipstick. Once it's all mixed, pour it into the empty lipstick applicator. Careful, this can get a little messy. Be careful not to fill it too much over the top. Once it hardens, you're done. Here, Kevin, why don't you give it a try? If you say so. Hey, that's actually pretty good! Checking the gram before class, Vicky? Hey, Vicky, how's your day going? Hold on a sec while I take this flawless model shot. Hey, where's that fan coming from? Whoa, you look amazing. I know. I guess I'll do a touch-up of my own here. Whoa, is that really me? I knew I should have gone to sleep earlier last night. Why'd I even come to class today? I'm an eyesore. Wait a sec. I know how I can get some color into this face. Have some colored pencils on hand? Perfect. Fill a glass with water and put a bunch of colored pencils face down into it. Now, let them soak in there for a few minutes. Ooh, look at the magic happening. It's been 10 minutes. Take those babies out. Now that the pencil's tips are soft, you can use them as eyeliner. Check out this fun rainbow pattern. Okay, Vicky, I'm ready for my Instagram story debut. <clears throat> Ooh, that's so red! How did you do that? I'll show you after class. It's easier than you think. Ta-da! See? Okay, let's take a quick selfie before class starts. Gorgeous, girl! Ooh, the classic kissy face. Hello, rainbow goddess. You're late, young lady. And you have a drink, which isn't allowed. Oh man, I just bought this! Hey, teach, sorry I'm late. Those hallways get a little hard to navigate sometimes. All right, move it along. Oh man, my throat is so dry. I really could have used that orange juice. Say, do you have a drink I could take a swig of? Whoa, Lily, why are you drooling all of a sudden? Hello? Anybody home? Sometimes when you want something bad enough, you'll start to see it. But as it turns out, Kevin knows exactly how to sneak a drink into class. To do this hack, take a plastic phone case and remove it from your phone. Once it's facing up on a plastic bag, take a sharpie and outline it onto the plastic. Once you've done that, remove the phone case for now and cut along your outline with a pair of scissors. Now you should be left with two pieces, see? Next, take a strip of wax paper and place it over the corresponding edges of your pieces before pressing a hot flat iron on it. Do this to three out of the four sides of the plastic. You should have what looks like a little plastic pouch. Now take a lid from a juice box like this one and put glue around its base. Before it has time to dry, place it into the small opening of that pouch so it serves as a little spout. Next, take your favorite drink and pour it into the pouch, filling it up most of the way. Don't forget to put the cap back on. Lastly, go ahead and put hot glue on the outer side of the phone case. Now stick the pouch right onto the hot glue. Once it's dry, stick your phone back into the case and enjoy your juice from your sneaky little hiding place. Need a sip, Lily? Oh, thank goodness. I thought it was dying. And if your teacher wanders on by, don't worry, you're totally covered. Yes, that thing is foolproof. Whew, made it by the skin of my teeth! But you remembered to bring a friend! <laughs> What's she talking about? <laughs> that thing's about to pop! Huh? This can't be good. Oh no! This thing is the size of Alabama! I need lots of foundation for this. <gasps> is that makeup? Teacher! Uh, shut up! 
I need this! Shut your mouth! Please! Stop! What's all that ruckus? Ugh. Jeez. Heh! <laughs> it's not that bad, right? <laughs> Who's up next? <gasps> Me! I, I know! Nobody? <gasps> Over here! Okay. Come on up. What's with that girl? Wait. I got it! Wanna hide your foundation? You just need a sharpener lid. Then pour the makeup on in. Then grab a glue stick, take the cap off, and use a blade to get it out. Once the container's empty, stick in your favorite makeup sponge. This is exactly what I need! Say goodbye, ugly pimple! I gotta be quick! Hope this can cover it all! I did it! There. Nice and smooth. Nothing to see here. Where did your zit go? You and your imagination. But you just had… Uh, uh, where'd your makeup go? Maybe I need new glasses. Ugh, glad I remembered to lock my stuff in my locker. That backpack was getting heavy. Hey, I totally forgot I had this in my pocket. An entire foot of delicious bubblegum goodness. That's about to be covered in dirt on the floor. Quick, Kevin, catch it before it falls! No! My gum! Gross. Unless you like lint hair and questionable brown stuff, this gum is ruined. Yikes, that's pretty disgusting. What the heck happened to that thing? Ew, get it out of my face! What do you need with my tape? You'll see. Did you know a tape dispenser can serve as a drop-free gum holder? Step one, make the thing look a little less like a tape dispenser with some fun paint. It looks pretty good so far. Now all you have to do is stick your foot of gum in there. Hey Lily, what's up? Hello Kevin. Now can I have the gum you promised me? Are you talking about this? Huh? Here, take off a piece. And you get the perfect size every time. Could this class get any more boring? What's that? Rules are rules! You just earned yourselves a test! Ta-da! Ugh. Ooh, this chalk dries out my hands! Look at them! Well, I do have hand cream. Is this too hypocritical? Ah, there. The nerve! Is she really using my lotion? Oh no, this isn't good. Shame! You must be punished! Please, I'm only human! Definitely not worth it. Or I could just be sneaky with it. How have I never thought of this? Have a glue bottle? Pour out all of its contents. Nobody's watching me, right? Now for the secret ingredient. Hand cream looks an awful lot like glue. And you're done! What a brilliant hack! My hands will be dry no more. Oh, that's good. Um, Bella? Is that glue on her hands? Oh, that's soft. Time for round two! Oh, has she officially lost it? Um, everything's fine. This is so interesting. Oh, hi! Look what I've got! A puppy! Wow! Can I pat it? Sure. It's called Fluffy. It's the perfect name! Aren't you the cutest? She is. Hey, guys. Hi. I'm so pretty. What? Move. No! Whatever. I'll pay you to change seats. No! I can't be bought! Okay. Oh, a cute little puppy! That's so unfair! Who does she think she is? I'm so mad! I've really taken it out on this chocolate bar. Hmm, wanna hold her? I'd love to. Yeah, I know how to get her back. 
nice and quiet. I'll cut the top off the chocolate wrapper. Now to squeeze it into her notebook. There! She's such a lovely dog! Oh my gosh! That puppy is the worst! So gross! It worked! I'll get rid of this. I'm back! Hello, Fluffy! Good girl! Is the coast clear? It's eyeshadow time! Excuse me. You know the rules. Hand it over. Back to work. Ooh. Psst, psst. Looks like paint, right? Replace the paint with makeup. They're the right size, see? No one will ever know. Just a stroke of a brush? You can do super fun looks. See? Incredible! All done! Here, give it a whirl! Don't mind if I do! Great practice, guys! That feels better. Wait, should I have notebooks or something? There. I need that thing that you write with. Uh, um, uh, a pen! That's it! Nope, not under here. What am I gonna do? Hey, smart girl. Yoo-hoo! Me? Yeah, can I borrow a pen? Okay, I should have an extra one. That one. Sweet, thanks. Oh no, it's broken! Hey, smart girl, this one is faulty. Can I have another? Be careful! Wow, two in a row. Uh, you're not gonna believe this. Take it. Here. Have this one. I hope she kept the receipt for these. Psst, smart girl. This is my last pen! Okay, fine! Wait a minute. This juice box could come in handy. Maybe the straw could help. This'll do. Take a pen apart. Apply some glue to the bottom of the ink tube, just like this. Next, take a straw and slide it over the ink tube, all the way down to the glue. Pens that look like straws? No one is borrowing these. Wow, these are so cool! Can I have a pen? These are straws. Sorry. Fine. Hey bro, you got a pen? Yes! Now I can get back to my work. As you can see, the colors of this painting are just divine. They evoke summer nights and the feeling of temptation. Oh! Okay, are you ready to get started? Let's do this! Don't worry, class. I'm okay. Art can be dangerous, that's all. Now get to work on your own canvases, please. I'll be up here if you have any questions or need any pointers. All right, I'm ready to make some of my own art. Excellent. I'm really feeling these colors. I need even more of these colors for my work. <laughs> colors! Give me the colors! More! These colors and these ones, too! Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Very nice. <laughs> yes, that's the fashion I like to see in my classes. Hmm, looks like I'm out of ink in this one. I'll just grab another one. Huh? Where do they all go? Hey, she hogged them all! Well, now what the heck am I gonna do? Some more of this over here. Yes! Exquisite! This is ridiculous. How am I supposed to work without any supplies? Hmm, wait a second. I think I've got an idea. Here I go. I love these little coloring books. Just gotta sneak up here. I gotta take them. Yoink! Mm hmm? Oh, I thought I heard something. Where did my cotton swabs go? My ears are itchy! Oh no, oh no. Wait, wait, calm down. Everything will be fine. There, I've got my spare supplies. I'm good. Okay, first stage of my plan was a success. Now to get to work. Gonna wrap this cotton swab with this tissue paper. All the way around. And now it's time for some washi tape. Ooh, I really love this purple polka dot one. So pretty! Now to just wrap this around the swab. It's looking great. But what I really need is color. Like this food coloring. I'll just drip the cotton end into the color. I'll give it a little test on this piece of paper. I saved my art project. And why make just one when I can make a whole rainbow? All right, back to work I go. Zoom! 
Hello, artwork. I missed you, but I'm back with more color. <laughs> I'm the best artistic genius ever! There. I think this might be my masterpiece. All right, class. Let's see your work for today. Here's mine. I absolutely love it. Mine is an expression of the dread one feels on a dark stairwell. Hmm. Okay. Let me take a closer look here. Okay, okay. I see your use of blue and highlights of orange here. Hmm. Okay. You have a collection of strokes. Oh, what's this? Where did these little art sticks come from? Excellent. I love them. Very good work, my dear. I'm gonna borrow this if you don't mind. Oh, sure. I guess that's no problem. Oh, right. My journal entry that I was working on. Ugh! Oh my gosh. What was I doing? Hey. How's it going? I'm gonna sit here, too. Ugh. Why can't I get this lotion out of the tube? Come on! This is being so dumb and frustrating! I'll just squeeze it super hard. Hiya! Oh, oh. Ah! What the heck are you doing? Oops. You got your lotion all over my hands and bag! I think my bag might be ruined! No! Listen, it'll be okay. We can fix it, I promise. I'll be right back. I can't believe she's just abandoning me. There's so much lotion on here. This is a huge mess. Okay, I can fix this. Got a cardboard tube and some glue. That should be enough. Now I have some paper to roll it up. Okay, that's good. I'll use scissors next and cut the ends. Just a few more. Time for some more glue. Now I can fold these ends in and glue them down too. My poor, poor bag! Maybe I can just wipe this all off. Huh? What's she doing over there? Oh, she's trying to clean it off. I better get back to work on this. She's still upset. Okay, those edges are all glued down now. Next up, markers for decorating. I'll use this yellow. Ooh, this is turning out great so far. Maybe this vacuum will help my bag. Oh, hey! Let go of my bag, you dumb vacuum! Yikes! It's out of control! Stop it! Stop it right now! Give that back to me! It's mine, not yours! Wow, she's really going all out over there. Just gonna draw a cute little slice of citrus fruit. I'll outline it too, to really make it pop. Eee, so cute! I love these fruits so much! I'm gonna add a cute little friend for them, too. Also, this strip of yellow paper at the top now. Nice. I'll add more. Time for some more decorations. Gotta be careful with my bubble letters. I'll color them in. This blue is pretty. I like it a lot. Okay, letters are just about done. Now I need this corrugated cardboard paper. I'll use it to close off this end of the tube. Then top it with more paper. Okay, here's the squeeze top for the lotion tab. Some more glue here on the edge of the topper. And glue it onto the top. Now for these patches of Velcro. They'll go on the inside across from each other. Now they can keep it closed or you can squeeze to open. The pencils can go right inside and then be safe. Wow! I am legit super impressed with what I made. Come on, baby hand! You can get off the lotion! I know you can! Hey, Julie! I'm back and I've got something for you! Oh, she's in baby hand zone. Hey, Julie! Snap out of it! <sighs> Come on, pay attention! This is important! Hey, it's a new pencil holder for you! Aw, that's so cute! I absolutely love it! Thank you so much! Here, you can have my old pencil case, too. I'm sure you'll love it as much as I did! Oh, uh, sure, I guess. Thanks, I suppose. This menu looks pretty good. Oh, hi! Glad you could make it! You look really nice. Would you like to look at the menu? Sure thing! That would be great! Whew, wow! It's kind of hot in here. Is it just me or are you hot too? Yeah, I don't really notice anything. Oh my gosh! I'm burning up here! I'm sweating so much! Ugh, that's better. Oh no! That's so gross! I hope he doesn't notice. Oh, what's that? So shiny! <laughs> oh, wow, you're so bright! How embarrassing! I wish I had some makeup to help. Hey, wait a second! My watch! That could totally work! Alright, I've got my compact. And now I've got my watch face. I'll just stick it on the cover of the compact and then I need my glue. A little bit of glue here, and then here. Next up, a watch band. I'll just glue these onto the compact. Now my hidden compact is ready to go. Alright, compact. Time to cut down on this shine. I still have time to save this date. Just a little bit more. Done. Phew! Oh, wow. How did you do that? You look amazing. 